Okay, so this is attempt number 12. Attempt number 12. Um, hi folks, um, I know it's been a long time, but welcome back to Mackenzie Photo. And I'm going to talk about a bit about where I've been and what's been happening. Anyway, roll intro. <laughs> Hi folks and welcome back to Mackenzie Photo. Now, some of you know what's happened and where I've been, some of you don't. Um, basically, at the end of October, I had a surgery scheduled to remove a tumour, cancerous tumour. And it was going to be just remove the tumour and it'd be cancer free. Unfortunately, that didn't go as planned. Um, and once they got in there, after many hours of cutting through scar tissue, they found that um, the cancer had embedded itself within the scar tissue and beyond, um, which basically meant they couldn't do anything. So they decided, which was the right decision, to close me back up and give me the unfortunate news when I came out of surgery that I am now classed as terminally ill from cancer. I have no chance of being cured. And that's why I've been away for so long. It's not been an easy road recovering from major surgery um, with that on your shoulders. Knowing that you have a family to tell and you have to adjust to life and dealing with all the stuff knowing that your time is very short now fortunately for me I've been told that I've got maybe a couple of years rather than a couple of months um, I don't know if that's true I hope it is I've got a goal I'm going to aim for 10 years whether I manage to make that or not is up to the gods. Um, if I have my way, I'll be here longer than 10 years. But anyway, that's besides the point. That, so that's pretty much where I've been recovering. Um, trying to figure out how to start doing things like this again, because I am a lot more tired. Um, in the surgery, they did damage uh, some of my inner organs and I'm out of breath climbing a set of stairs now um, so I can no longer go hill climbing that's completely out um, so a lot of my photography is going to be either really close to the car or in the studio pretty much um, which limits me a lot but that's okay I'm going to have to work with that um, I'm still choosing to do YouTube. Um, I've got a new mic that I'm testing out and hopefully everything's going according to plan. It's recording on the computer. I'm watching that I'm not spiking. Um, I've also got the Rode mic on top of the um, GFX 100S because uh, my lav mic didn't record the other day. I've got some... I, I did a, an amazing speech. I did it in one take as well. About 20 minutes of just me talking this um, without any ums and ahs, and it was fantastic. And there's no sound. Uh, I've got the video, but there's no sound, which is useless. Um, so that was great because I had taken everything back down. I thought this, I'd, you know, thought I'd got everything right, put it on the computer, no sound. Nightmare. Anyway, the, the whole point of this video is just to say I'm back um, and be on the lookout for more videos um, yeah Mackenzie Photo's back I'll be trying to do at least one video a week if not maybe more um, 
maybe sometimes less. It just depends on how I'm feeling. But I just want to say thank you for all the kind messages that people have sent. It was really appreciated. I will say there is one person in the comments who I'd quite happily not hear from again. Um, it's a person that's put a comment which I'm going to leave there talking about alternative medicines. What you're putting out there is utter lies and it disgusts me. I am terminally ill and you're saying my cancer can be cured by some alternative diet. I've been fighting this for three years. Do you not think I've looked at every bit of research I can? So you sitting there reading an article on Facebook, oh, that some medical diet is going to turn around cancer. You should be utterly ashamed of yourself. No one knows what going through cancer is like unless you have cancer. I hope no one ever gets this disease ever again, but unfortunately that's not the case. There's going to be lots of cases like mine where it's undetectable until it's too late. But there's also going to be a lot of people that don't check themselves regularly and then it gets too late. So if you take anything away from this is please don't spread inf misinformation and to check yourself out and if you find anything get to your medical professional doctor don't go on Facebook don't go on Web on WebMD go to your doctor they're trained for this they're there to make sure that you stay alive if you don't stay alive they don't make money it's in their best interest for you to stay alive. So, if you're worried about something, go to your doctor. If you find a new lump or bump when you're having to feel around, go to your doctor. If you've had a cough for more than three weeks, go to your doctor. Get yourself checked out. That's all I can ask. Don't end up in a situation like mine. Anyway, so, enough of the bad, um, and let's focus on the good from now on. So, I'm going to say thank you very much for watching this short video, just to say I'm back. And I will also say, before I go, that my website is still up, and on my website, my shop's still up. And in the shop, you can get yourself some really nice fuck cancer hats and t-shirts they're not that expensive by all means go on order one you won't be disappointed you'll be supporting me and my children and you'll be saying fuck cancer because cancer's a cunt and I really hope that they find a cure for it in my lifetime but fuck cancer it is an utter bastard. Fuck it. Fuck it all. I don't care about the, the swear anymore. Um, but yeah. MackenziePhoto.com If you go to the shop, you'll find this stuff. There's also limited edition prints. And they are very limited edition because I'm going to expire at some point. I will sign one and send it to you. And you never know. Might be worth something one day. Um... And also I'll be putting other stuff up periodically as well. So yeah, go to the shop and just because I'm being nice, I'll give you a discount code. McKenzieFoto-10. Put it on the bottom of the screen there. I'm not going to put it in the description. It's only people that watch the video that get it now. So yeah, McKenzieFoto-10. Go to the website, get yourself something nice. It'll support me, it'll support my children. And I greatly appreciate it. And you'll be spreading the word about fuck cancer. Um, there is censored versions. I know you don't. Some people don't want to get upset people too much. So yeah, there is censored versions as well. But anyway, I'm just going to say thank you very much for watching. Please take care, and I'll watch you. Out. <laughs> I'm just going to say thank you very much for watching. Please take care, and I'll watch you. Out.
just going to say, please take care. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you in next week's video. Bye-bye.